the animated list widget. We start by creating a list of items, and then we will create also a key that is a global key. This will be used for the animated list widget. We need to create a function to add items inside the list. First, we will say items.insert. We will insert at the index zero, and we will add a string item with the number of the last item. By example, it will be item one, item two, item three. And because we don't use the set state, but we add items inside the same state, we will use the key that we have created, dot current state, and we will insert an item inside. We will add the new item in the index zero, and the duration will be one second. We need to create another function for remove the item. For this, we use the same logic, the key dot current state dot remove item. But in this one, you can see that we need first the index and then a builder. So we will remove the index that we have received from the argument and we will create a builder. The builder will return a size transition and the size transition is just used to make the item go smaller and smaller until it disappear. The size factor will be the animation that we receive from the builder. Then we have a child, which will be a card. We will add a margin inside this card, a color red, and the child will be a list style. In the list style, we will have the text deleted and the style will be a font size of 24. If you go over remove item, you will see that you need also a duration. We will say that the duration is 300 milliseconds. Because we remove it from the current state, we need to remove it from the list also. So we will say items that remove at index. Now we are ready to build the UI. So inside a column, we will have our children. The first one will be a size at box of height 10. We will have an icon button. When we press on it, this will add an item and the icon will be icon add. Under we will have an expanded widget and inside we have the animated list. This one will have the key that we have created earlier. Inside we have the initialize item count. We will start at zero. The padding will be an edge and sets that all 10. And we have the item builder. You can see that this one need the context, the int and the animation. So we will have the context, index and animation. We will return again the size transition. This time we will use it to make the item go bigger and bigger until it have its final form. We will use a unique key for all of these size transition. We will have a size factor that is the animation that we receive from the animated builder. The child will be a card. Inside we have the margin 10, the color orange accent. The child will be a list style. The title will be a text. And inside we have the index of the list of items. This will be by example, item one, item two, item three. The style will be a font size of 24. In the trailing, we have an icon button. The icon will be delete. And when we press on it, this will trigger the remove item with the current index. With all this, when we press on the icon button, this will add an item. And you can see that with the size transition, the item is going bigger and bigger until it have its final form. And if you click on delete the item, this will remove the item in 300 milliseconds. This is how you create an animated list with Flutter.